Hi, I'm Robert Alexander from iChem Labs, and this is the NMR Signal Seek widget tutorial for ChemDoodle version 5. The NMR Signal Seek widget simulates carbon 13 and hydrogen 1, or proton, nuclear magnetic resonance and also associates peaks with nuclei. The widget provides full information about each simulation for in depth analysis. The leftmost box on the widget is the main structure panel. This is where the simulation results for the structure being analysed is displayed. To the right of this panel is a set of panels for displaying the simulated NMR spectra with carbon-13 displayed on top and the proton NMR displayed below. Both the main structure panel and the spectra are interactive. You need to drag a structure from the doodle board onto the NMR signal seek widget button or, if it is already open, you can drag the structure from the board onto the main structure panel. This is the only way to obtain a structure to work on. When you do this, the proton and carbon-13 NMR spectra will be instantly displayed. Below the main structure panel are two function buttons. The Add to Doodle Board button places both simulated spectra onto the current document. It does not place the structure that is displayed in the structure panel into the doodle board. The settings buttons opens up the settings window where you can customize any variables. The display TMS toggle allows you to hide or show the reference peak, while the roof effect toggle does the same for roof effects. You can also toggle between Lorentzian or Gaussian line shapes. And then the following four options are sliding scales, which allow you to fine-tune each option to a great degree of accuracy. Lastly, you can choose which solvent the molecule is to be dissolved in. To recalculate the simulation with the new variables you have inputted, click the Simulate button. Once you have submitted your new information, you can continue to interact with the spectra. Click and drag along the x-axis to zoom in, or double-click to revert to the original view. You can use your mouse scroll button to change the displayed scale of the y-axis. In addition, you can hover your cursor over the individual peaks in the spectrum. This will highlight the corresponding nuclei in the main structure panel. Alternatively, you can hover the nuclei and the corresponding peaks will be highlighted. When either of these are hovered, it's the same effect. The chemical shift of the nuclei will be displayed directly above the molecule in the main structure panel. Clicking on either nuclei or corresponding peaks will display more simulation data, which you can use to gain more information about multiplets. The simulations in the NMR signal seek widget are based on empirical algorithms with a database of incremental constants compiled from various publications and some unpublished work. If you want to view these references, go to the Help menu, select References, then under Algorithms, go to Spectroscopy, then Nuclear Magnetic Resonance. You can view related references here. Further information on NMR simulation is provided in Appendix E of the ChemDoodle User Guide, starting on page 204.